Hey guys, this is Mike here from Ball and Bowers, and today we are going to be feeding my biggest bower in the collection, and also my oldest bower in the collection, my eight and a half foot BCI Colombian girl Dottie, and she is down here in the bottom cage with the red light. She's the biggest girl in the collection, and she also is the oldest girl in the collection, and we are going to be feeding her today. And right now she is on the uh, breeding feeding schedule. She usually gets a large rat bi-weekly. Right now we have her on a good size medium rat weekly. You know, just basically because if you add two of the good mediums that I've been feeding her, they kind of equal to like a jumbo. So she's usually getting something that's just, a you know, a little bit bigger than what we're going to feed her now. You know, like a, just a regular size lodge, I'd say, a small lodge. And she gets that bi-weekly and um, she's very... Uh, good size already and we just want to put a little bit of weight on her so we figured a good size medium every week for say she's been on that for four weeks now and we're gonna do the rest of September also on that feeding schedule and then in October we're gonna just bring her back down to probably about every 10 to 12 days and then in November we are gonna pair her with a um, with a male this year so, without any further ado, guys, uh, let's get going. And also, real quick, Bernie the Burmese is out. There he is. That's my male Burmese. He's about three and a half feet long. I got him a few months back. He's a great addition. I don't breed Burmeses, but I've been thinking about it for a future project. I um, He is actually head albino, so I am... Um, Hopefully going to be grabbing a albino female soon off a friend of mine and hopefully in a year or two when these guys get you know a little bit bigger I can breed them you know and that'd be something cool you know try something new because I usually just stick with boas I do have um, 14 boas here at Ball and Boas so um, and this is like I said the biggest girl right here Dottie she is the eight and a half foot BCI Colombian girl So, let's get a rat in there, guys. Just give me a second here. And this, the rat is in there. And we took out her hide. Her hide's right there so you guys can get a good uh, shot at her eating. And let me just hold this rat up. And that's the rat. And for a size comparison, we'll put it up to this paper towel rack right here. See, she is a pretty good size. <laughs> oh, she's holding on to that with their life. But, yep, she's a good size. Oh. All right, well, let's get her down. Bear with me, guys. Let me get her in real quick. Hold on. All right. Doing. Mm. Old Dottie knows she's there now. Like I said, Dottie is an old girl. She's going to be 12 years old this coming year, 2018. And there we go, guys. And Dottie has got her. All right, guys. Dottie's got her. So, um... We will get back to you with part two of the video. Oh, Rats, Rats taking his last couple of breaths right there. That's one thing. I, I mean, I do hate feeding live, but this snake right here, Dottie, she won't take anything. 
but live so unfortunately I do have to feed her live so uh, that's just one of the things about owning snakes sometimes they won't take frozen thawed so you do have to put a live animal in there and um, you know feed your snake guys you know it's it, it sucks to do because you know it is killing a live animal but that's just the cycle of nature so you know that's just how it goes but we will get back to you in a few moments with uh, part two of this video and um, We'll watch Dottie take this rat down after she uh, gives it a good squeeze for a few minutes. So, this is Mike here from Ball and Bowen, guys. Saying, uh, well, saying we'll see you soon. <laughs> Peace.